here at PASALEX showcasing Grafica, the graphing community of Catalonia. At PASALEX, we have a wonderful booth uh, showing uh, innovative technologies um, produced by spin-offs, by research groups participating in, in GraphCAD. We just have a, an event in the main stage of PASALEX uh, discussing uh, some of the projects uh, and with some of the investors participating in GraphCAD. We ask you to join the GraphCAD revolution. devices 
So we can print on flexible substrates like uh, polymers, uh, different kinds of polymers and paper also. So that way we can afford uh, making sensors thin and uh, in that way we can make uh, thin and almost weightless sensors to measure uh, temperature, humidity or other physical, chemical uh, sensors in uh, hard, hard environments to measure or with uh, uh, disponibility, very low disponibility of space. Hello, my name is Clara Barreneche. I'm the Head of Innovation and Business Development at BIS, the Barcelona Institute of Science and Technology, representing seven research centers of excellence in Catalonia. I'm here also on behalf of GraphCat, the Graphene community in Catalonia, that gathers 10 um, members of um, Graphene and materials in Catalonia, research institutions, as well as industry members and associate members. We're here, we've been here at Puzzle X, the first edition of a Frontier Materials event in Barcelona. We're here to represent uh, GraphCAD and this, uh, and all the members, ICN2 and ICFO. And our main goal during these three days was to have to showcase all the interesting research projects that are being developed within the GraphCAD community with industry members, um, as well as all the, all the graphene and other uh, 2D materials, frontier materials, aligned with the main goals of the, the event, which is really how can we bring these amazing research being developed in the labs into the real world, in the reality, in the market. We've been really happy to see all the connections that have been made through the spin-offs represented here, uh, the main industry representatives of big multinational companies uh, from US, from Canada, from Singapore, from China, from all, all the, the whole world, including Europe, uh, that have expressed an interest, and not only um, about the projects being developed, but also the future potential of these technologies. We're also happy to have received and be in um, exchange information with members of the investors community uh, corporate venturing programs that have uh, expressed an interest in knowing more about these, all these uh, projects being developed. Um, of course, uh, this requires long-term vision because uh, these are research projects that are more or less developed. Um, but we've seen um, a really strong interest in um, being able to understand what is the, the, the real potential of these technologies in two years, in five years, in ten years. Um, so all spin-offs, research centers, I think are really happy to, from the results and we have more work to develop uh, following up on all these contacts being made, but really happy about that. So GraphCat and this, we wanted to be partners of this first edition of Puzzle X, focused on frontier materials, because we are very much aligned with the sustainable development goals, which tackle energy, sustainability, um, new materials, to really um, find solutions to real problems. Puzzle, we appreciate you. Come back next year. And this is actually a startup 